Mary, points from turnovers in this game, 20 for your team, I believe nine for them. Just what you can say about capitalizing on those extra opportunities. Yeah, that was actually something, you know, we, we talked about in the scouting report is we had to have 10 plus and, you know, they really honed in converting those turnovers into points and we doubled it. I asked them for 10 and they, they doubled it. So it was um, really good of my team to just focus on, you know, the game plan and it was an unbelievable effort. Points from your bench, 25 for your team, three for FDU, just what you can say about the people that rotated in. Yeah, I think we've just been practicing really, really well. Everybody is pretty much in every rep, um, the way we've uh, constructed practice. So, you know, whether you're the first team or, you know, the second team, everybody's been practicing well and having an opportunity to play. There's not a lot of standing in practice. So I think that had bold, that bowled well today um, for bench. Sierra and Hayden both spoke about the fact that the non-conference kind of gamut that you had to run through, prepare them for this moment. Just what you can say about what you had to go through non-conference and how that can help you right now. Yeah, I mean, we had some unbelievable experiences where, you know, we were in the Colgate game and we were up and then we kind of let it just falter in the fourth quarter. And those experiences where we have it, have the team cut it, like FDU did, and I can bring that back up. Hey, we remember what we did in the fourth quarter against Colgate. And they're just like, yep, we didn't, we got we can't let up. You know, we have to put our pedal to the metal. So I think, you know, we learned something from every single one of those games. And like Hayden and Sierra said, like us having veterans helps. At one point, I think the last five minutes, all our starters from last year were on the floor. And that's why we were able to secure the win. First NEC game, first NEC home game, both ends up being a victory for you. Just what that says and the statement that it makes for Lemoyne in Division One in the Northeast Conference. Yeah, I mean, it's just unbelievable effort. You know, like I, I always try to stay present and, you know, um, thank, thank you to Bob for coming in to talk to the team. Like he just said, this is the first. It's the first. And as I'm able to reflect, no one's going to be able to take that away from our team. And, you know, it's just an unbelievable effort by just the staff and the players. I asked the, the team to obviously describe how they see the team at this point. As their coach, what are three of the words that you would use to describe as you move further into the NEC? I mean, the first thing is resilient. You know, to go through the schedule we went through and they fought every single game. You know, that it was unbelievable today. The things that we saw against Colorado, against USC, balls on the floor and we're diving for them. I think that the resiliency of this team is unbelievable. Um, they work hard and they care about each other. You know, like Hayden talked about, you know, where we were in September as a team has grown so much to where we are right now. And I think it's just going to continue to grow. Congratulations. Thank you.